So yesterday they announced the All Black squad, today it is the All Blacks 15's turn and we will be looking through exactly with who has been selected. A lot of the players on the cusp of getting selected for the ABs are in this side and a few new names getting scattered in there as well. But looking through, first of all at the Fords, they are going to be as follows, Aiden Ross, Finley Brewis, Tamaiti Williams, Angus Ta'aval and Ollie Yeager. They are the props that they have gone with. For the All Blacks 15, then looking through at the hookers, it will be Asafa Moore, Brody McAllister, and also the youngster George Bell. Now he hasn't got a huge amount of experience, George Bell, but he has been playing for Canterbury throughout the Bunnings EBC. He's a bright young talent, and it's kind of surprising that they've gone with him this early. I guess there's a bit of pressure on the youngster to make sure that he is able to deliver. Looking through at the locks, it is going to be Patrick Tuipolotu. He is the captain of the All Blacks 15. Alongside him in the locks, it is Josh Dixon, Zach Gallagher, then also in the full back for the All Blacks 15, it will be Marino Makaeli Tu'u, Dominic Gardner, Billy Harmon, Luke Jacobson, who some felt could have been close to make it into the All Blacks, and then Christian Leo Willey will be the last name in that four pack. Now looking through at the back line, a few of the players that we are about to mention, some thought would have been in the All Blacks. First of all, Brad Weber, TJ Perinata, they are the two halfbacks that they have gone with for this Northern Hemisphere two match tour. Then at the fly halves, it will be Cam Roygaard, Damian McKenzie, and Bryn Gatlin. So McKenzie was the question mark of whether he would be heading to the ABs. Instead, Peter Fetter got the nod to still be that third choice fly half for the ABs. It's Damian McKenzie, he finds himself in the ABs 15 side here. Bryn Gatlin also there, his Chiefs teammate. Then looking through at the rest of the backs, it will be Bryce Heem, Alex Nankavell, Levi Amour, Balen Sullivan, Mark Talia, AJ Lamb, and Ruben Love. So one of the Sullivan brothers have been selected in Balen. They haven't gone with Zahn Sullivan here. I'm not sure whether or not that is due to some sort of injury that he has got for himself. He'll probably feel a little bit unlucky to be missing out on this opportunity. So the ABS 15, they will be taking on Island A and also the Barbarians, which is coached by none other then Scott Robinson. So it's going to be an interesting contest. Those games also taking place throughout the November International Test window and we will be covering them on the channel as well. But nonetheless, do let me know what you think of this ABS 15 side. Are there any other players you would have loved to see make their way in there? And also, how do you think they'll go up against this Barbarians and Ireland A side? But nonetheless, thank you all very much for tuning in. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel and I'll see you all for the next one.